Have mercy on me, O God, according to your steadfast love. In your great compassion blot out my offenses. Wash me through and through from my wickedness and cleanse me from my sin. For I know my offenses and my sin is ever before me. Against you only have I sinned and done what is evil in your sight. So you are justified when you speak and write in your judgment. Indeed, I was born steeped in wickedness, a sinner from my mother's womb. Indeed, you delight in truth deep within me and would have me know wisdom deep within. Remove my sins with hyssop and I shall be clean. Wash me and I shall be purer than snow. Let me hear joy and gladness that the body you have broken may rejoice. Hide your face from my sins and blot out all my wickedness. Create in me a clean heart, O God, and renew a right spirit within me. Now the tax collectors and sinners were coming near to listen to Jesus. And the Pharisees and the scribes were grumbling and saying, This fellow welcomes sinners and eats with them. So he told them this parable. Which of you, having a hundred sheep and losing one of them, does not leave the ninety-nine in the wilderness and go after the one that is lost until he finds it? When he has found it, he lays it on his shoulders and rejoices. And when he comes home, he calls together his friends and neighbors, saying to them, Rejoice with me, for I have found my sheep that was lost. Just so I tell you, there will be more joy in heaven over one sinner who repents than over ninety-nine righteous persons who need no repentance. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy and immortal, have mercy on us. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial, and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. I believe in God the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth. I believe in Jesus Christ, God's only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended to the dead. On the third day he rose again. He ascended into heaven. He is seated at the right hand of the Father, and he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. Amen. O Lord, I cry to you for help. In the morning my prayer comes before you. Let my mouth be full of your praise and your glory all the day long. Every day will I bless you and praise your name forever and ever. Awesome things will you show us in your righteousness, O God of our salvation, O hope of all the ends of the earth and of the seas that are far away. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and all that is within me. Bless God's holy name. You redeem my life from the grave and crown me with mercy and steadfast love. Lord, hear my prayer and let my cry come before you. The Lord be with you, and also with you. Let us pray. We give thanks to you, Heavenly Father, through Jesus Christ, your dear Son, that you have protected us through the night from all harm and danger. We ask that you would also protect us today from sin and all evil, so that our life and our actions may please you. Into your hands we commend ourselves, our bodies, our souls, and all that is ours. Let your holy angels be with us, so that the wicked foe may have no power over us. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. Almighty God, bless us, defend us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. <laughs>